These self-care apps for 2020 are going to change your life. Hi beautiful, welcome to or back to my channel. Today I'm giving you seven of the best self-care apps for 2020 that must not be missed. Stay tuned. <laughs> Before we jump in, if you want good vibes, make sure you subscribe and click the bell next to it so you never miss a video. And if you like this video, please remember to give it a thumbs up. So, the first app is called White Noise Light. It's a bank of beautiful sounds that helps you to drift off to sleep and wake up from sleep peacefully, and I mean peacefully. It relaxes you and reduces stress, and it also helps to soothe headaches and migraines. Here's how it works. When you go into it, this is where you'll land. So if you go to sounds, you can see your whole list of sounds that are already on the app to choose from, and they are amazing. You've got all different ones. So what I love is that if you go to this little clock symbol, you can choose how long you want the sound to play before it automatically shuts off. So if you want to fall asleep to a sound but you don't want it to stay on all night, you can choose it to stop after 20 minutes, after an hour, after two hours, whatever you like. And then the best part of this is that you can set your alarm clock for the morning to be one of those sounds. So you can wake up in the Amazon jungle if you wish. The second self-care app is called Dailyo. Dailyo is a private digital journal. You can log your daily moods and activities that caused those moods. You can set and track personal goals and it is pin locked so no one else can access it but you. Here's how it works. So you click the little plus button today and then you can choose your mood these moods you can also edit and add on to but they have some basic moods there for you so let's say you want to log that you feel good then you can choose from a list of activities that you might have been doing and again you can edit them and add your own activities in but let's just say it was i was spending time with family click family click save and there you go it logs it for you and what happens over time oh by the way in that entry let me just edit it down here in the add notes section you can still type more if you don't just want to log a mood and you want to actually write some things out you can do that and keep it like a normal journal and then what happens over time if you go to stats down here once it's got enough information about you when you've been using it for a while, you will get a monthly mood chart so you can see your patterns of your moods. And then down here, like you can create goals and then obviously monitor how well you're doing with them and what activities you do the most. But what I love is down here where it says often together, you can see which um, activities normally trigger certain moods. Sometimes we're doing things, later on we feel a certain mood and we don't make the connection. So I think that this is really, really powerful for understanding your own moods. I wanna know if you keep a journal of any kind. Let me know in the comments down below. App number three is called Workout Women, but the exercises are for men too. Just saying. Workout Women offers short and effective workouts, scientifically proven to improve health, no gym or equipment needed, and you get a virtual personal trainer with voice and video instructions. Here's how it works. So you go into the app, it will take you to your dashboard, and your workout is already waiting for you down there where it says daily seven, you click that and there's your personalized workout, which is personalized to you because when you first get the app, you put in your details like your weight and your height and things like that, and it personalizes everything to your specific needs. And then you click start, let it load, say I'm ready. Welcome to your daily seven. Are you ready? And the music always gets me pumped. That's what I love about it, it's got music. And as you can see, I'm just going to pause it because you can't hear me. Um, you get a video tutorial for each exercise so you know exactly what you're doing. Now, if seven minutes is not enough for you, down here on the workouts tab, you have plenty of different ones. If you go to all, look, you've got full body sweat, leg day stretch, all these different things, and you can go to seven minute, beginner, fat loss, butt, abs, you get the idea. App number four is called Smiling Mind. Smiling Mind offers you five to 15 minute audios developed by psychologists and educators designed to assist you in dealing with the pressure, stress and challenges of daily life. Here's how it works. So you'll open the app and you'll land on your dashboard. If you go and click my programs in the bottom left corner, these are the programs that, again, the app has personalized especially to you based on the info you put in when you first signed up to the app. 
or you can go across to all programs and as you can see there are just untold amounts to choose from um, and each one is a bite-sized duration meditation of some sort there's just so many this is so amazing this app you can do these meditations anywhere and because they're only about 10 minutes you could do them on your break you could literally do them any time of the day which i think is so cool app number five is called motivation quotes motivation quotes allows you to read through hundreds of quotes find motivational books You'll get notifications throughout the day with motivational quotes and you can add your own quotes and set notifications for those. Here's how it works. So when you open the app, you'll be taken here, you'll be taken pretty much straight to a quote. If you go over here, this is where you can set your reminders, how many quotes you wanna be sent per day, what time they should start, what time they should finish. The bank of quotes are here in categories. So as you can see, there are all different ones and then this is where you can add your own so if you're reading a book or you're on social media or you hear someone else say something and you think hmm that's a quote i want to remember and that i want to be reminded of you can add quote here type it in save it and then you can choose when you want the app to remind you of that as well before i jump into this next amazing app if you're liking this video please remember to give it a thumbs up app number six is called Yupa. Yupa allows you to have quick conversations with your artificial intelligence assistant aka therapist that changes your day if you don't feel like talking listen to Yupa guide you through mindfulness practices instead it helps you to understand your emotions better and get insights on anxiety depression and many other symptoms here's how it works it will take you straight to your chat with your robotic therapist if you will so as you can see i told them that i wanted to film two youtube videos because you can tell them your goals and then they keep you accountable so it's asking me have you done it which hello that by itself is great but the chat goes so much deeper than that it asks you questions and then based on your answers it puts together a picture so it can give you things that are actually going to help you and it's it's literally like having a virtual therapist but it's not a real human being so if you click on the insights tab once you've been using it for a while, like I said, your therapist will start to gather information about you, notice patterns, and then give you insights here. So, so far, I've been very calm this week. So I've only logged the emotion of being calm. So it tells me what makes me calm. And then you can see all the little activities around it that make me that way. And as I keep using it, I'll find out what makes me grateful, what makes me tired, what makes me okay. So it's similar to Dalio in that way, only you actually get an AI therapist to talk to as well, it's really cool. And then if you click on health over here, this is great because you can basically give yourself a screening for a few different mental health problems like anxiety, it's even got borderline personality, depression and social anxiety. And you can actually add more as well. Now obviously that's not to replace a doctor's diagnosis or anything like that, but it's just cool to be able to check on your symptoms and just get a rough idea. Make sure you check out my life-changing apps for girl bosses video because even if you don't work for yourself, all of those apps are really good for just productivity and organization in general. And of course, if you want good vibes, make sure you subscribe. Until the next video, I wish you health, wealth, and high vibrations.